So I'm Michael, and this is Michael, and we're playing... And this Final is Vaughn! That is Vaughn. We're playing Final Fantasy XII, Final the Zodiac. Fantasy, the Zodiac Exterminator. Yes, and look at us killing brats with glowy, beady red eyes. As red as the line that connects you. Two LP? What is that? Uh, lip points. Vaughn is actually a prostitute. God, that thing's after me. <laughs> I mean, I literally don't think you can lose this fight. Do you get items in this game? Yes. Maybe. I don't rem It's been 10 years. I don't <laughs> remember. But I, honestly, if this this I remember this fucking sewer. It's been burned into my mind. <laughs> More than The second anything. that it came onto the street, I was like, oh, oh no. Oh, wow, fucking no. You got them all yourself? Yeah, you didn't help at all, you little <laughs> shit. Well, it looks like he's got a lot of detail to him. I can't wait to check out his abs. I heard they uh <laughs> they, they messed uh, they fixed that up, right? Oops. <laughs> totally forgot. Oh, you get his ass. <laughs> he's busy today. Might have some work to do. the sixth character is. I've got other um, work to do. There's hey, this guy, me, his friend, out, we've been down here. the He'll bunny chick. Hands. Han, no, Han Solo. Han Solo. Uh, the princess. The princess and the guy that killed the king. That's six. That's everybody. There you go. And you get like, you get everybody like the exact same time, which kind of annoys me. I like, I like the really? game. Really? Yeah. I, I like the games where like you, it, you know, you spread out a you bit. You spread out and you get to, you know. Play with each person a little yeah, that's bit. What, that's what I actually liked about 13. You got to play with all the characters. They weren't all good characters, but <laughs> you got to play with different people. Two years after the fall of Delmask. That makes you 17 now? Just like my big bro. That got killed. Got wrecked. For, for no reason. <laughs> I, I, I still am convinced that a normal conversation probably would have made things okay. <laughs> hey, Bosh, how's it going? <laughs> You're a street rat. You're like fucking Aladdin. Which way you going, Chow? Ha! You fucking churro. You churro. Get out of here. <laughs> like, dude, why couldn't you get like a freaking lizard man or a freaking pig guy in this game? Those guys are so much cooler. They ain't hot, though. I don't give a <laughs> fine fuck. You want to like here? Who's the worst character in Final Fantasy X? Kamari. But wasn't he cool looking? No. Yes, he was. I don't get <laughs> Oh Karen. God! Hey, that's mine. What do you mean yours? <laughs> You've been stealing. Again. What are you for? What happened? No, he's seventeen. <laughs> we need you to be there. Hello. You know she has like. One if you're locked away in a dungeon. Oh, what? Am I the leader? Tube now? feet. I don't so, know. So wasn't the like the protagonist of nine like a thief or something too? You you watch yes. Okay. On, so because I think there's a, it's kind of a callback well to as that as almost you. like because they haven't had a. You give that back. You know, what do, you do the soldier doing? a lot, and then. The well, I think they really tried to get away from what they did with seven and eight, where Cloud and Squall are both kind of like, kind of broody, like, darker characters. Well, I mean, they, Tidus did like was completely different than that. You know? Yeah, I know. I'm just saying, like, nine started it heavily, where it was like. Now I never actually played nine. I, really? I, I didn't have a PlayStation One, so I only played. Oh, right, right. I only played. I didn't play seven, eight, or nine. Well, that's. Upsetting, except for eight. <laughs> I know but I did play the original I one. I played a little bit of two on the Game Boy Advance. Uh, I think I beat four because I, I just had this memory of going to the. I mood. think you did too because I think that was on Game Boy Advance, and we. I think we were playing that at the same time when we were yeah, like you go to in the moon, middle school right? or something. You go to the moon at some point in that one, right? Yeah, it's like the last level. Free to go where I will. I'm missing all. He's the gonna plot. be the Sky Pirate King. Oh God, her eyebrows. Yeah, they I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> How are those abs? Oh, I haven't seen. I, you know, I was so distracted by other things. I haven't seen his abs yet. Is there a setting to make his abs better? Because we need to make them as good as we can. As make well them. defined as possible. All right. I'll you're, check. Yeah, you need to turn around and get a close up. Why is everyone wearing like? Oh, okay. I told you this tutorial is never gonna end. 
What could Miguelo want? Um, probably. money. Whoa! World map has been added to the party. The world map can join your party. Yes. I just you know I think this might be the before fast travel. Oh my god! Look at that. <laughs> You can see, like, we're not even zoomed in. You can see those abs. Holy shit. That's as close as I can get. Oh, man. But, yeah, so I think this is, I like, mean, a little before, like, fast travel was in every game, too. So, <laughs> so turn on the battle speed to slow. No, you you probably <laughs> wanted to turn it to fast at some point. We'll turn it up a bit until I see how horrible it is. Well, then go back to go back to go to slow, and then and then you'll see. Uh, I don't know if I want that. Uh, yeah. to, go back. Okay, there's no go there's back no down ab more. function. Right, no, yeah, keep that no, on. Go, probably. go back to go back to two for a little bit, or the three, the third one where it was before, and then. Why is there no middle ground? Because you're either for it or against it. Like in all good arguments. Only a lizard man deals in absolutes. <laughs> uh, why do I... I don't know what that is. All right. What I got. Yeah, no Whoa. fucking shit. <laughs> Come on, man. Okay. If I recall correctly... And you may not have the ability to do this, but you essentially use your LP to unlock other things on a grid. And in so those sphere grid. Yeah, but the grid also uh, has weapons on it. So you can't use certain weapons until you've uh, unlocked it on the grid. And I thought that was And a also name. you <laughs> can't really see what's next in the grid, if I think if I recall it like Oh. Uh. <laughs> this guy's so lonely. He doesn't really look it, but he's very lonely. He's, he's having <laughs> a good time with the big guy. And remember, if they have a happy face over their hands... I will not talk to any of these people. Dude, no, talk to that guy. All right, maybe this guy. Yeah. Oh, Bonga. That's the name of a lizard, right? Bongas. Okay. Are these the same? Like, there's sort of like pig lizard men. No, there's a lizard. And then there's like lizard lizard men. No, there's a pig guy and there's the lizard guys. Right. So what are these? Those are the bonga. Are they both bongas? No, the other guys aren't bongas. Oh, what was this guy? He was... A rabbit strash. No, that's just the name of the people. That yeah, <laughs> so I was like, I thought that was a name at first. I do like that there's a whole bunch of random people you can talk to, just like in old school, like that are useless. That just like that are useless. <laughs> they just give you like names. I like, like useless. Well, I kind of like it. it just it, it adds to the ambiance of the game. Like they, it, it, I feel like in thirteen and fifteen they kind of took that away. Like they're like people don't like to talk to random. They took everything away in thirteen. <laughs> hey, you could walk in a field forever in that oh game. Oh my god. Oh, that noise. Oh. You hear that so much in this game. Oh. <laughs> I need two people close together. Oh. See, look how cool the lizard people are. Why can't you have one of those in your party? I was waiting. Canal said you needed something. Who's his voice actor? This is so familiar. <laughs> Damn, I'm gonna starve. So you want me to find this courier? Hey, no problem. No problem. The desert teams are trouble. <laughs> You're probably gonna die. <laughs> no, I've arranged for some replacement goods from Tomage over at the Sand Sea. So you want me to go to the tavern to pick him up? Actually, I asked Kipes to do that. Wouldn't you tell you? <laughs> I asked a useless child to do this. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe that's why we have no lizards in this game. <laughs> I couldn't have this guy be in your party. Like, if I help him die. Holy shit, spoiler alert, Rex actually died. What the hell? Okay. Let's do it. Oh, God. Bobby Edna. What else did he do? 
Nothing. This is his first and only roll. Can I go in here? That was weird. It was like an MMO door opening. <laughs> yeah, I'm interested in some weapons. What you got? Oh, I see. License needed. Yeah. There's a very Final Fantasy Tactics looking uh, little portrait up there. <laughs> yeah. So. So I can't use anything, so I suck. Yeah. Gotta have the license, man. <laughs> can't. <laughs> so Bobby Edner. He's 28 yeah, like, years there's old. There's a Moogle. He's 28 years old now. Holy shit. That, now? Means, that means when he voiced this, like, he was literally our age when he voiced this game. Like, holy shit. He's 28 now? Yeah. So he was like... He's like... He was born a month before me. <laughs> hey, look, it's Bucko. <laughs> <laughs> so when did this come out? 2003? Six. 2006? Yeah, I think 2004. So I think 10 came out in 2003. <laughs> they hired some, like, random 18-year-old guy to be like, Fuck, Van, go get me the shit for the store! Well, he, was, he did a little bit of work, and he was like... A, like I, I don't understand how, where they got this guy. Like, like... I, like <laughs> Who did he know in the industry? He must have been banging somebody. <laughs> like, <laughs> you fucking Yoshitaka Amano? Who was it? Oh, his role in the film Spy Kids 3D Game Over earned him the nickname Spy Kid <laughs> from his fellow. I Arsene. see how he got it now. Okay. Everyone, everyone knows Spy Kids 3 oh, was the he best. Was an Agent Cody Bakes, Kangaroo Jack, and Monsters Inc. This one of those is good. This is why <laughs> courier didn't get here on time. Okay. Creature spotted in the ester sand. He also oh, the dancing in music. Attack of the Killer Tomatoes. Miguelo sent you too, did he? He's a busy man these days at Miguelo, if I dare say so myself. I don't envy him the work, though. Not a bit. Man, he got a freaking good bit for this, man. Like, this is like... This was his breakout role. <laughs> and then he went on to have a singing and dancing career. What's this? Well, after the masquerade ball, he was all over it. Just wait, man. Check out this picture of him. This is his... <laughs> oh my god. That's right. Vaughn, you should give it a shot. Yeah, Mason, you gotta put this one up there, man. This guy... Is that Eminem? Uh, look at this. <laughs> He looks like an elderly lizard man to me. I could see it. Not, what? He's, he's the guy that... This is Vaughn, not the Oh, uh, I thought you were looking up the lizard man. No, this is the Vaughn, man. This guy, like... You gotta be more clear who you're looking up. What? I was saying that Vaughn's voice sounds so familiar. <laughs> you meant the lizard guy. Vaughn's not the lizard guy. <laughs> they could be voiced by the same guy. They could be. The oh, Rogue yeah. Tomato. Do you want to hear all the details? Yes, yes I do. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> I fucked you up, man. <laughs> you can't just do that, you'll miss out. Actually, uh, I, I, at one of the Dallas Comic Cons, I actually saw the guy, the voice actor that did uh, Titus. He was there. And he, it was actually... Did they ask him to do the laugh? I think so. <laughs> Good God. <gasps> oh, shit. An Albed primer. Just a little something to tutorialize your first hunt. Ooh, an Orichalcum. An Orichalcum armlet. Oh, there you go. You don't know how to wear bracelets, idiot. You're not licensed. Pinello seems m like she's much more famous. <laughs> a lot, like, a lot more famous. She did, she voiced Padme and all the animated stuff for Star Wars. Couldn't get, what's her face? Academy Award winner. Uh, Thor's girlfriend. 
<laughs> I just this freaking Bobby Edner picture just cracks me <laughs> up, man. Its top credits involve Spy Kids 3 and Final Fantasy 12. Those are two weird things to have right next to each other. <laughs> All right, are you done giving me crap? Dude, who's that guy? That's Tomaj. Oh, oh, Han Solo actually had a bit in Daredevil. So, man, this guy. This Harrison guy. Ford was in that? No. The, the Daredevil uh, the Daredevil himself. Uh, ben Affleck? Yes. <laughs> I love that. I don't know the name of the guy who did the Daredevil in the show. Charlie Cox. I know. So, the guy that voices the Han Solo-esque character in this is also leads a very good career. He was in Teen Wolf, the show, and uh, Daredevil. You can't change your mind. Do you need me to repeat this? Repeat it. All right. Okay. Oh, I got this now. <laughs> the little portrait is great. Yeah. A lot of these guys are, are... Oh, my. Oh, look at the license board. Oh, oh God. You got 12 Zodiac boards each, huh? Uh, what the fuck is this? I don't remember this at all. <laughs> uh, this is new. This has to be. Shikari Bushi... Foe Breaker, Time Battle Mage. Hit preview license Monk, board real quick. Machinist Olan. Here, go hit, hit, hit square. Hit square on one of these things real quick. Okay, so this is what I remember. They just broke it up a little bit, I guess. I guess they did? Oh, God, this is extensive. Yeah, and... Like I said, you don't know what you're getting yourself into. Well, apparently you do, because it's right there. Oh, shit. Yeah, but, like, there's not a quick way to look at everything. Like, you know, if you wanted to, like, is each one is, like, a symbol, right? So you could be like, oh, hey, um, I wanted to look at this. But, like, I'm looking for that specific symbol. But you have to, like, go out and it's annoying. Wait. Oh, that's all that does. But yeah, I don't think this was in the last, like the original one at all, because I don't, like, I think everyone had their own board and that was it. Uh, so what, um, so like if I get something on one board, do I always have it if I go to another board or am I like only when I'm using the white mage board can I use... Like I said, if I recall correctly, this was not in the original, uh -huh. so. <laughs> what, are, what are these? <laughs> A warrior who fights nimbly across hill and dale. I can learn sight unseeing. Goes from afar. Wield crossbows and bend time to their will. Inflict elemental weaknesses. The original license board is identical for all six characters in the original release, while in the Zodiac version is different for each job. So essentially, okay. So, just pick one real quick. Real quick, I'll show you. Pierce armor. Just, just uh, hit the preview one real quick. So, for example, in the original one, this is like all the other ones are put stuck. All, all of them are put stuck into one thing together. Mm -hmm. And everybody started in a different spot in it. So, they did like the sphere grid. Essentially, but it was a big fucking square. <laughs> and in the square... So, they did the square grid. Yes. And so... The cube grid. Yes. I'm sorry. And so and essentially, like, one person started in each corner and then, like, in the middle. And then, like, you could just go in any direction. But all the, like, you know, gun stuff was together so that, that the guy with the gun can 
you know, Han Solo can like become more gunny. So uh -huh. this is already seems better than it was before. Well, that's good. So what's Vaughn going to be? I don't know. I mean, all I have right now is a dagger. So I was going to pick the dagger class. What's it, which one's that? Um, one of the weird words. Shikari. Or you should fight nimbly across hill and dale. <laughs> oh. Okay. You get a technique called first aid. <laughs> Sounds basic. I like bushy. Do bushy. We can learn sight beyond sight. I'm guessing everyone has accessories one. Seems like it. I wonder if you you should probably get that first in one of the in the one of the classes that you want to explore more, and see if it. Unlocks um, I want to fight across Hill and Dale. I think so. So, huh. At some point, I bet you can move around. You can't do anything even on the Shikari board? Maybe. Oh, there we go. Uh, so we want accessories. Alright. Alright, go back. Let's see if we can save one point now. Huh. So how do you get to, like, over here? Uh, teleport? I, I, I don't know. <laughs> teleport? Well, back in, the, back in the day, it was literally a block, so you didn't have to... <laughs> you eventually got to where you wanted to go. They have the oil status effect in this game. It's like yeah. tactics. Why? Well, yeah, it's like really disjointed and all over the place. Yeah, like I said, it used to be a fucking square. Can you go back and look at the other license, like the other classes again? Uh, go back and see. So, yeah, look, um, that one for everybody. Okay. So maybe it's going to be. You want to jump around a little bit later when you can. All right. I'm freaking wasted enough time looking at squares. But yeah, that threw me a loop. I wasn't expecting that at all. Vastly improved. I, I'm going to tell you straight up, that is way better than it used to be. <laughs> and also, it probably helps prevent that thing that I was talking about, how the game, like, you just, like, leave the game on, like... There's Jom. <laughs> Jom? <laughs> how you doing? But, yeah, I bet you... So, so like, there was a specific weapon that, like, people could bum rush to get to. There's some, some, yeah. some, like, legendary spear, and you could get it, and then... The spear of the Zodiac? It might have been that one, actually. And that spear helped you kill that boss that I was talking about, because it, like, it was, like, super effective against him. And then you could just get everybody to use one, apparently. I'm going that. to the Esther Sand, so I don't care. We're going to hunt us a tomato. Oh, I didn't equip my thing, did I? It's like, you got the license Instant to do death. it, and... I got a license to wear bracelets and kill. Whoa there! Let me see those papers. Do I look like I have pockets? Oh gee, that's too bad. You see, it just so happens that your provisioner for the fate tonight, he sent me to pick up a few choice morsels for the uh, console's dining pleasure. He wants Why'd you put another in there, Sonny? I got the red transit right here. You see? It's human trafficking. How does that not fall out of my hand? I just hate to see the console upset because this food was already on time. And I sure hate to see him take it out on you. The Lord Console is a great man. I know one that got fancy such a trifling man. You got a license to handle paper? <laughs> Move along, boy. Wouldn't do to keep the console waiting. Right. Gates are closed after this. What a tight ship they run here. You got a license for those pants! Why didn't Vaughn just say, yes, here it is, and that's it? <laughs> wow, the legendary... Um, because he's a rapscallion. <laughs> he is a rapscallion that has difficulties with authority. 
All right, now no more saving until the rest, until you beat the game. Okay. Got to keep going. Go fuck those tomatoes up. No more saving. <laughs> yeah, there's a lot of NPCs. I need to find. You want to know what the pig guy yeah. is? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> really? <laughs> is that a hat? Or you just have like a gem on your head? Now you have a little hat. This is erstwhile adventure. Yeah, he's very erstwhile. <laughs> it's a really good word, though. I've not <laughs> like uh, something like he's an erstwhile adventurer. On your he'll way. bring up the, he'll handle the rear word. I assume I'm assuming that he's got like a Scottish accent. Look at that. On your way out of the city, are you? <laughs> the tomato beast they run in a muck on the bluff. Don't get yourself into no bother, do you hear? Yeah, like I mean, we put a little Irish there, but at the same time, I think it's mainly Scottish. Well, I can't differentiate between those two because I'm racist. Against pig people. Oh, oh. Because I don't know what the name of their like, race is. What the is. fuck are you talking about? Oh, there's a the T Rex. <laughs> and they're worried about the tomato? <laughs> yes. Oh, God. Ah, uh, yes. There it is. This guy's jamming. He looks like that guy from Dragon Warrior Monsters. Dude, he's cracked out. This is, this is not the right guy. Cactite. All right, we got this. All right, we got this. You know, just... Hacha! Attack right. from behind for bonus damage. Wait, no, that's only Final Fantasy 15. Oh shit! Oh, he's too strong. Oh, there we go. An item. Yeah, one LP. Oh. Ah, <laughs> fine. Okay, so the, if they're red health bars, do they aggro? Is that the deal? Yeah, the red one means they're attacking you. The blue one means you're attacking Well, like, it. like that one has a red health bar. Oh, well, I don't... I just think that's its health. But... Cacti has, like, a green health bar. It's not green. It's not green. What... What are you talking about that the the cactus is green but that's not green that's, what it's yellow it's clearly a different color than red then. but it's not green green means go all right <laughs> open that pot i'm getting to it oh no that guy hates me i know magics you... steel steel shit. get away from me Earth stone. Oh shit! You can make some uh, some cooking. Okay. <laughs> Is this a FF11 all over again? We gotta find some fire crystals. Fire crystals, man. <laughs> Is it not X? No. Oh uh, oh <laughs> oh. Okay. Dude, there's Final Fantasy 15. I've been playing and, and I do this thing where I go, like, it says push X, but I push it too early and I jump. And I do it like five times. Yeah, I'm like, pretty sure I did that too. And I'm just like, why? Is why this... is it X? <laughs> yes. Um, now I'm ready for tomato time. You're almost dead. I'm only half dead. I got five potions. How bad could it be? You have five potions? That's a lot. Steal from that fucking tomato! Alright, wait for it. Gotta charge this shit up. And you walk there without having to do anything, right? No. I stole a oh, pebble. Oh shit, throw that pebble at him. <laughs> oh god, oh, so bad! Oh shit, you're gonna die. Ugh! <laughs> he just like becomes a vampire. What the? 
I can't jump. You cannot <laughs> jump in this game. I also can't go off that cliff. Might as well do that, I guess. <laughs> oh, just throw it at my face. <laughs> Whatever. I, it, I don't, like if it's you, have you seen like you like you like crush the potions into your hand, like into your face. It's, it's, it's a really cool animation. I was. It's, it's, this is like he uses a okay. good potion. They like crush it into the like. So, oh God, T Rex. So was the point just that enemies can move? Yes. A valuable lesson indeed. Do I have to like bring back its head? Galbano release. Uh, I yeah. Yeah, uh, of course. He's Rex's favorite. Never thought I'd see him growing out here. It is a desert. I still can't believe that guy shanked Rex for like no reason. <laughs> Time to call it a day. Rip Rex, hashtag never forget. <laughs> hashtag lilies for Rex. <laughs> hashtag lilies for Rex. Should I fight that T Rex? You may want to save. See, I'm wondering... You never played the Xenoblade games at all, did you? No. Okay, so they really like to throw, like, really high-level enemies that you're intentionally supposed to avoid in, like, low-level areas. Oh, God. Though they make it... They usually make it, like, really obvious. Well, it's like that in... Uh... So I'm just wondering if it's, like... I attack the T-Rex and just get one-shotted, or... I would not be surprised at that. I got a wolf pill. Okay, so you get experience and LP separately. Yes. Okay. So... That's interesting. <laughs> so you can just, like, kill... Weak crap, I guess, and get LP. Do you, you stop get, earning like, LP eventually? No. Everything's too far. I was gonna go get like two more points, but whatever. We're getting close to a stopping point here. Um, I have to turn in my bounty. Yeah, turn All your right. bounty, and we'll, we'll call it a quits. I'm gonna get some some excellent tomato soup rewards, I'm sure. I, I don't think that's what happens. We have what, what, what's going on here? Oh look at these guys. They don't Oh what? man Is that the erstwhile adventure uh. over there? Go stand next to him. Oh yeah, oh, we've been we... dodging, wouldn't you say? <laughs> 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 what the hell? Hapless merchant. <laughs> this guy's an idiot. I'm hapless. Probably because he has no eyes and he's wearing a blindfold. Fucking ceremony. I want to. I want in. I want to turn in my, my stuff. Oh, that guy. It's kites. Paquito. This must have just happened when we pulled up. Now Was there, what? Do we know anything about the ceremony? I don't remember they're talking about they're, they're talking about a ceremony. Ooh, a royal chocobo. <laughs> Open the gate. Wait a second. How can you let these chocobos through the gate and not us? What kind of a badass looking chocobo, actually. Yeah, he's looking way cooler than you do. Why isn't he the main character? Yeah. Well, don't worry, the other guy's coming back. I don't even remember that guy's name. What was that guy's name? <laughs> Which one? <laughs> the guy that I thought was the, the other main character that, you know, got shanked, like, in the first three seconds of the game. Oh, my lilies! Oh! <gasps> Uh, we, that does it. 
Hashtag release for Rex. Hashtag release for Rex. And we also gotta probably lose those from our inventory. Yeah, you're right. Nello's got weird hair. Like, like I, I know it's a Final Fantasy game, but like, it's like oh, it's like almost trying to be too natural at the same time, just like looks too stiff. You know what I mean? Like, like I don't get it. Like, like it would make more sense on Vaughn than it does, does on her. It's so odd. Doesn't she have like pigtails? But they're not like they're not normal pigtails. Like they're like fat and weird spots. Like. Not. So she's not very good at doing her own hair. But Vaughn's really good. Maybe she should have asked for some help. Don't give me a scare like that. <laughs> You're lucky that ended where it did. I guess they yeah, stay up yeah, that's kind of unnaturally. Like, yeah. She just uses a lot of hairspray. I mean, that's a lot of hairspray. Like if it was just if they were just down a little bit, it would be a lot more <laughs> sense. Okay, Even Vaughn's got some poop, like flippy up hair wait, too, but like, but like he's got kind of coif, I, I a coif. I don't know. So sorry, I was talking. I was I was looking at her like physics. Look, look, look her hair's normal now. You see that? Well, now it's CG. But why would you? Why would you wear that corset like that guy does right there? It's what's in. Hey, that's the guy from the. That's the guy. That's the guy, man. Her hair's normal now. What's up with that? Hey, what's up? His is just dude. His hair's look, looking good too. <laughs> Holy cow! He's, he's got he's got a good set of hair. <laughs> a good set of hair. Oh no! How's back to doing weird things again? What's she has up? she has powers of gravity. Make sure that's her job role. Time mage. I give you your new consul, His Imperial Highness Lord Bane Solidor, Commandant of the Arcadian Empire's Western Arm. Your Excellency. <laughs> the ceremony's dumb. I'm out of here. It's a weird little pedestal thing. <laughs> you get a stage dive? Hatred you look upon your consul. With yeah. hatred you look upon the empire. Probably. With envy you look upon my hair. There was little point in asking. <laughs> Why did you no ask? <laughs> I harbor no idle hopes of frustrating that hatred. Nor shall I ask your fealty. That is We're just gonna kinda hang out. And rightly so. King Ramanas loved his people. Strove to bring you peace. His was a rule worthy of your devotion. Even now, was... he remains Man. among you, protecting you. No, he's dead. He's so dead. What are you talking about? He's as dead as that one guy in Rex. I would ask only that you do your king. Hashtag honor. Lily's for Rex. <laughs> Together, let us embrace the peace His Majesty would surely desire. Two years now divide us from war's bitter end. Yet still its shadow looms over all, stifling the infant peace. A fall only you may That's fucking what war does. <laughs> Here, war gets rid of peace? <laughs> this guy makes a lot of sense. I will defend Dalmasca. <laughs> but Brutus is a noble man. Here I will pay my debt. I swear it now. I have a chocolate bar on my neck. And Lady Ash be gone. They stand ever at the side of their people. In honoring peace, you do honor to their memory and to Dalmasca. What I ask, I ask plain. My hopes now rest with you. Oh, this guy's fucking evil. <laughs> <laughs> Please do not revolt against our takeover. Thank you. Oh, the slow <laughs> clap, man. Look at that. Like, that's the fastest slow clap of all time. Man. I know we own you now, but please do not fight back. That would be bad for peace. You don't want that. Don't want to fuck yeah, up the peace. We are going to be best friends. Just trust me. We, You know, you like me. Oh, I God. like you. Oh, whoa. <laughs> it is magnificent. 
Take this cathedral, for instance. Elegant. Magnificent. Burn it down. <laughs> oh my god. Did you seriously say elegant but whimsical? I'm gonna write a book and that's the title. Elegant but whimsical. I like this guy. I think this evening's banquet. May it please your excellency. Gallo, your highness. God, this guy should totally have been a party member. This guy is so cool. Why would you try my booze over here? I, yeah, I, mean, I like it. That's enough of highness. Though indeed I am our emperor's son, I am no prince. Or I am illegitimate. I am but an elected official and nothing more. I, I meant no disrespect. <laughs> Uh, what about eight? Is this supposed to be eight bit theater? You know, where it was like. All right. As former chancellor, that's now the king. I appoint you my new chancellor. Thank you, my lord. I'm glad. I'm glad. You know, you're finally like. You know, it's like. It's like. And now I'm putting you to death because no chancellors can be trusted. <laughs> and like, wait, what? <laughs> Shouldn't have trusted me. <laughs> Always the royal vizier. <laughs> That's something I want to re I gotta redo. Man, that was that was. Some we gotta make this more Aladdin. It's always the royal vizier. I think they mentioned that in there too, actually. One day we'll figure out the name of that pig man. I do something. That erstwhile adventurer. <laughs> What erstwhile adventures could he be having right now? Ron. Eh? Ron, you haven't heard a single word I've said, have you? Nope. His place has changed so much. Like it's not even defying hair again. <laughs> like the Empire of Swallowing. Maybe she just. Maybe she has like wires in the pigtails that attach maybe. to like her head. Maybe it's a weave. Like those aren't even no. real pigtails. <laughs> you think they'll let us in? What is a fate? Are you crazy? The it's party, a man. And we don't have an invitation if you hadn't noticed. Tell you, it's the party. I mean, I know that it's the party, but what the heck is a fate? <laughs> it's the party. It's a Miguelo to get you in. Or go see old Dallin in Lowtown. Why the sudden interest, Bon? Your lips do not match you. at all. I'm going to take back what's ours. It's one of the downsides of going from low res to high res, <laughs> to be honest. <laughs> I noticed it with uh, all the Final Fantasy X too. <laughs> like, they just got lip flaps. Yeah, this is like, hop, 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 hop. You know as well as I do, the first thing you'd buy is an airship. Oh, hey, yeah. Ron, Sky Pirate of Damasca. He's got a nice ring to it. Ron for Sky Pirate King. Would anyone really say, hey, old pirates? <laughs> an airship. I don't know. Maybe. But not through Magello. Okay. Can I get my tomato juice? Did you see that lizard man with his big hammer thing? Look at him. He has got a lot of pierces. I like that we just randomly looked at that. Yay! Him. And with that, I think we should end this part of the amazing adventures of Tomato Slayer Vaughn. <laughs> Dude, you see that prostitute? This one? Yes, yeah, so that's actually exactly <laughs> what I was talking about. This one? What are you? <laughs>